Hey guys, welcome back to the pink envelope. I am unboxing today, gentleman's box. I haven't done one of these in forever, although I feel like I haven't done many unboxings recently. Hmm. Anyhow, gentleman's box started with this one basic box forever ago that I unboxed, and now they're like a mecca. I've had to write down all the options. They have the item of the month. You can do a tie at 15 a month or a sock at 12 a month. They have the Gentleman Box Classic, this guy, which is just $25 a month. And they now have the Premium Box. It's $100 a quarter with over $300 worth of goods inside. And you have to qualify. There's limited quantities, so you have to go in and uh, see if you qualify. I don't really know what all that consists of, but it's really explainable on their website, which is also very user-friendly. Um, shipping is included in the price. They do offer gift subscriptions, and you guys can cancel anytime. So if you're finding that you're getting enough of... <laughs> guy stuff for a little bit and you want to put it on pause and cancel you can and then you can loop back so let me give you show you was what comes inside this box like an example of what the typical box i don't know if their boxes still look like this this one's a little bit older i um had it for a little bit but they were pretty snazzy and then on top you have this and it breaks out all sorts of things inside has tips on the back Sorry, it's backwards. I'm having to film in selfie mode since it's just me here. Um, but it just has like um, dressing tips, style tips, talks about the products inside the box. Um, it's really a cool, well done magazine. I've been very impressed. Ooh, what is this? Raise a glass to the world's highest rated bourbon. Oh, it looks like it's just an ad. Wah, wah. I thought you were hooking us up. Such a tease. It looks like it is the theme of the box. Maybe the hookup's still in there. And so this will be my husband's favorite box <laughs> ever. Okay, so it looks like we've got some Jim Beam Black Extra Age Bourbon. Um, what are they made of? Woodchuck? I don't know. Coasters. They're actually pretty nice. Pretty cool. We'll put them out by the uh, whiskey barrel we have out back when we're chilling and drinking. We've got a beautiful lapel pin, Camden Burgundy. Let me show you guys this. Can y'all see it? That might help them. Good looking lapel pin. My hubby doesn't wear these very often, but I think I might be able to get him on the bandwagon. He's been more of a sport recently. AJ Murray's Face It Like a Man Lotion in Kentucky Bourbon. Apply it liberally as needed. I smell it. Oh, I can smell it. That's sad. Oh. I don't know. Like vanilla bourbon, maybe? I think it smells like vanilla bourbon. I'll ask my husband's opinion on what he thinks it smells like. What is this? Oh! So if you do whiskey over ice, and it's the, the soft mold, so when you fill it with water, it's easy to pop them out. We do use these often. That's a good idea to put that in there. And then we have a coordinating sock to go with the lapel pin. And this is something I love that they do when they match everything up so that we don't have to. Nice filling sock. A Southern Scholar. And then there is a tie that also goes with it. You know if I see that? By Salt and Dapper. <laughs> That's cute. So I got one, two, three, four, five, and this is a set. Six items in this box for I think about $25 is what it was. Um, I'm going to take a few pictures and I'll share some stuff, but I'm not going to do a full blog post on this. I've got links in the bio if you want to check it out. Um, it makes a great gift. Sometimes guys are so hard to buy for, so this will be a good variety. And then, of course, if you find you fall in love with stuff, you can go order it because all of the information is in the Handy Dandy magazine. All right, gentlemen, box. Thank you so much. You guys have a fabulous day and more unboxings coming your way soon. Bye, y'all.